Travis Lule made his return to practice for the first time in six weeks after injuring his shoulder in a game against the Montreal Alouettes. Anytime you're you're coming off uh, of an injury, I mean, it's it's physical and it's and it's mental. You have to you have to prove yourself you can do it, but you have to be physically capable of doing it too. And again, it's it's a progression. It takes time. The Lions were happy to have their offensive leader back on the field. Travis is 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 a leader out here, you know, for this organization. You know, Travis is 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 as good as, as anybody in the league at playing this position. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm just trying to, you know, help in any, any way that I can until he gets, he, he gets ready to go. It's huge. You can see it, uh, you know, when he breaks the huddle down. You can see it when he gets back into the huddle. Uh, guys miss him. You know, he, he's a veteran presence. He's a guy that's been here and done well. And, and that means a lot. It's the most competitive position in football, but the three Lion quarterbacks say they have a great relationship. We definitely get along well. We're always kind of joking around, and, and we have each other's back. So, uh, you know, we get along well, and it helps us on and off the field tremendously. we got to help each other out as much as we can. I've always been a big believer in um, that quarterback room being very important, and the guys have to communicate well. Um, it's so much easier if, you just, if that mutual respect is there. Lule won't be starting on Friday against the Calgary Stampeders. All signs point to Pierce getting the call for that game. Pierce finished the last game strongly and made some plays that looked like the Pierce of old. You know, I think, you know, of all things, it might have been the block that really kicked yeah. him off and got him going. But that's, you know, that's that's been Buck's uh, forte throughout his career. Uh, whether it's a run, a scramble play, or something like a block, um, you know, he's the type of guy who will do that stuff for his team. So uh, it was cool to see. Obviously, it was it was huge for our team in that football game. Probably should go the other way back. Friday marks the final game of the season for the Lions before they head into Saskatchewan to start the playoffs. Sook Perwal in Surrey for BCIT Magazine.